Hello guys, welcome back to NFT Inspo. For today's video, we are going to show you how to create multiple product pages in Shopify. So if you're interested, let's start a tutorial. So I'll be showing you two ways on how to create multiple product pages very easily. So if you're not aware yet, there's actually a very specific uh, UI or a function here that you, you, you could use and products. So in this case, by default, you have your products here. So all the products that you have right now is it here. Now we in this products here, we could actually create collections. So that's underneath the product section here. So when you click on collections, uh, these are basically a list or group of products that you could showcase on your website. Now, in this case, you will be utilizing the collections uh, function here for us to create our product pages. Now, in this case, what we need to go, uh, go through first is we first have to edit a few things on the product itself. So in this case, let's go ahead and go back to products here and we want to go to one of our products. So in this case, I have a sticker product here. And from here, what we need to do is you need to scroll down a bit until you see the tag section. Now, in this case, if you want to, maybe for example, you want to showcase a specific product without actually moving anything on any of your collections or your pages, well, it's important that you use this section here that says uh, tags or collections. Now, in this case, if you use tags here, it, this is a great way for you to organize all the products that you have on your shop. So in this case, I have the, I have this tag as art. So since this is a sticker, it is tag as art. Now, the same thing with painting, this is going to be tag as art, but for shirt and shoe, I actually tag this as clothing, as you can see here. So in this case, go ahead and tag all the products or the sample products that you want to uh, try and doing. So you could go ahead and follow along with this video. So let's go ahead and go to collection next. And from here, we want to create, uh, create a collection. So let's go ahead and click on create collection at the top, right? And from here, maybe we want to tag this as an art collection. So let's just say art collection. So let's make sure that we actually input the correct name. And from here, you could choose the two type of collection types. So you have the manual and the automated. So from the name itself, if you choose manual, you'll be able to basically manually add up all the products that you have on this collection. But since we don't want to uh, move anything or we don't want to move much and we want everything to be automated on our website, well, what we need to do here is choose the automated and we want to choose product tags here, which we did before. So we tag our products accordingly and we want to choose the type of tags. In this case, then, since this art, it's going to suggest me the following tags here. Let's just choose art tag here. And from here, let's just click on save at the top right. Now, since we also want to create another collection for clothing, so let's go ahead and create a uh, collection again. Let's say a uh, clothing, clothing, clothing type of collection. So same thing, we're, gonna, we're going to use the automated here and choose clothing instead. And just hit and save at the top, right? Now, once we've done that, the next thing that we want to do here is determine what type of pages that we want to create. So the first way that I'll be showing you to create your uh, product pages is the utilization of navigations. So at the online store here, go ahead and select that and you want to go to navigation. Now from here, we want to create another menu, but in this case, let's just edit the main menu here. Let's go ahead and click on it. And from here we have home catalog contact. So if you actually open up our website here or our store, so we have the home catalog and contact. So we want to go ahead and add a menu items here. Let's say we want to say this is shop with us. Just to give you an idea. Now here we want to link this to all of the products that we have right now. So let's just choose all products. And here just click on add. Now from here we want to add another menu item here. But instead we want to say this is art. And we want to redirect this to a specific collection which is art. So let's go ahead and click on collection. And from here let's just choose art collection. Now from here, just click on add. Now, as you can see, these two uh, sections or menu items are going to be separated, but you could also just click on the section here and drag this below the shelf with us. And as you can see, it is now added here. Now, one more thing, let's go ahead and add another menu item here. And let's just say this is going to be clothing. Now here, collection again, and we want to choose the clothing collection, just click on add. Now from here, let's just click on save at the bottom right. 
And from here, let's just go back into our store and just reload our store here. So sometimes it might take multiple reloads, so let's just wait for it. And as you can see, this is the shop with us option. So when we click on the drop down, or if we click on the shop with us first, it's going to do nothing as we already have like uh, two sub categories here. So let's go ahead and click on art here. So when we click on art, it's going to showcase all of the products that are tagged as art. Now, if you go to clothing, it's going to showcase all of the products that are tagged as clothing. So as you can see, we only have one product here because one of our products is currently inactive, if I'm not mistaken. So let's go ahead and go to shoe first and check this one. As you can see, shoe is now showing. Now, this is the first way that I am talking about. So the other way for us to create this one or to apply this uh, specific creating of pages, well, we have another one. So let's go ahead and create our page. So instead of utilizing, we'll be still use, utilizing the navigation option here for our store, but we first have to create a new page. So let's go to online store here, go to pages, create a, a another page here. Let's just say it is going to be shop with us. And from here, let's go ahead and click on save at the bottom right. Now, if you want to customize this page here, you could go ahead and click on customize template first. But for now, let's just go back to navigation. Just to give you an idea, go to main menu. And we want to delete this two subcategories since we'll be doing this another way. So just think of it as adding another or a new shop with us here. And we want to edit this one. Instead of all products, we want to link that specific page that we just recently created. So let's go ahead and just click on show with us page here. Click on apply changes. And from here, let's just go ahead and click on save at the top right. Now from here, let's just go back to pages, go to shop with us. And from here, we want to customize our template. Now in our template, the good thing about this one is we can actually add collections. So since we are editing our specific page here, just give you an idea. I want to delete this one, already added this before, but I'm going to showcase or I'll show you how to do it exactly. So here I've just deleted it. So let's go ahead and add another section. Click on add section here. You want to choose collection list and it's going to add a section here. And from here you could go ahead and select this one. And from here you could choose the uh, collection that you want to showcase, like for example, our collection. And here we want to showcase our clothing collection. Here, click on select. Here, let's go select art again. Just click on select. And as you can see, when we go ahead and visit our website here, just click on save at the top right. I'll be showing you what it's going to look like. So in here, we have the shop with us. So let's go ahead and click on the shop with us link. It's going to show us the collections that we have right now. So we have our collection, clothing collection. So if you choose our collection here, it's going to load up another page wherein all of the art or the products that are tagged as art will be shown. And that's about it. So hopefully this video was able to help you. Like and subscribe to you. And if the inspo, thank you for watching.